What's going on, my gente? It's your girl Barbie305, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, on today's video, I'm gonna talk to you guys about the kind of content I'm gonna be creating to put up on this channel. I'm also gonna tell you guys a little bit about myself so you guys could get to know me. Actually, that was supposed to be the first video for me to make, but things didn't end up working out the way that I wanted them to. I actually made the video and then I kind of didn't like it, but I was still gonna post it because I made it and it took me forever to make it. And somehow it just got deleted off my camera. So that was that. Um, I guess it was just a signal for me to remake another video. And then when I decided to make another video, I thought it was a great idea to try to prank my boyfriend with my makeup and that didn't work out as well. As you guys are going to see on the first video that I put up. Actually, I might even change my mind. I might put this one up. Who knows? But whatever. Anyways, point is, is that I tried to play a prank on him and it backfired on me because I ended up getting upset. But it wasn't his fault because at the end of the day, I didn't do my makeup as bad as I should have. So, yeah, whatever. Anyways, um, so... Let's start off with getting to know me a little bit. I'm going to go on the internet and I'm going to grab a couple of basic questions so you guys could get to know me. And yeah. All right. These are called get to know me, tag me questions. Where did you grow up? I grew up here in Miami, Florida. By the way, I had to look them up because I'm not Instagram famous, so I don't have the time to be going on Instagram and asking people what they want to know about me and what they don't want to know about me. Hey guys, so I just wanted to apologize real quick on the sudden change of the color or quality of the video. I have no idea what I did here while I was editing, but I messed it up and I couldn't find a way to get it all together again. Some of you may not know this, but I film and edit these videos on my own. I recently learned how to even use my camera. So it's not like I'm a professional videographer or editor. And I'm trying, okay? Just bear with me. When they probably don't even know who I am, so I'm just going to get them off here. But yeah, I grew up here in Miami. I was born in Venezuela, but I was raised here. And I'm a Miami girl for life. Where do you currently live? Miami. How tall are you? I am 5'1". Dogs or cats? Should I even answer that myself? Mamas, can you answer that for me? Oyeme. I love you. Ooh. So yeah, I am a dog mom all the way. I have three little babies. She's being a little spoiled because she's sick, you know? So, yeah, you know how it is. Um, but, yeah. What year were you born? 1989, baby. Um, what is your favorite drink? I'm going to show you guys my favorite drink. This is my favorite drink. Tequila. Yeah, I love Don Julio. But I am very picky with my alcohol. I was a bartender for 12 years. So, um, out of tequilas, I only drink Don Julio. It could either be Blanco, it doesn't gotta be 1942, but I do not mess with Patron. I don't care if they give it to me for free. I I just I can't do it. So yeah, I do Don Julio and Clase Azul. Those are my favorite tequilas. And my favorite drink will be a margarita. Also, amaretto sours are delicious. Um, you're wearing perfume. What scent is it? It is Flower Bomb by Victor Rolf. It is my favorite perfume. Tea or coffee? Honestly, none. But lately, I've been drinking cafe con leche sometimes. Are you done? Hey, I'm trying to make a video here, Colkers. 
Okay? Are you gonna relax? Can I can I go back to the video? Anyways. Um, I don't really like to drink caffeine. It gets me really not feeling good, I guess. It gets my heart rate going like at a million miles per hour and I'm feeling I feel like I'm having like a heart attack. So I just, I don't even drink Red Bull, I don't drink coffee, but lately I've been having cafe con leche in the mornings, which I should not, I should really stop that because then I get really anxious throughout like half of the day and I don't even want to do anything. What sports do you play or have you played? I used to be a dancer. Um, I know a lot of people don't consider that as a sport, but it is. I used to be a dancer, a cheerleader, and I used to do gymnastics, yeah. <laughs> have any books you read change your life yes the millionaire next door for sure um also what is your favorite movie i have a lot of favorite movies but one that i really really love is armageddon yeah <laughs> Who are your favorite YouTubers? Mm, I would say Catherine and Austin, for sure. Um, who else? Oh, I like to watch Amber, Amber Show. I don't know how to say her name. I really like her little DIYs and stuff like that. I also like... Hey guys, so I decided to stop the video one more time since I realized I blanked out on a couple of the questions here and there. I actually didn't even look at them before I started filming. But anyways, I left out this one YouTuber who I actually admire a lot and I learned so much about makeup through her video tutorials. Her name is Carly Weibel. I hope I'm saying her name correctly. And well, about four or five years ago, I literally have no idea what the hell I was doing when it came to doing my makeup. She was also one of the reasons I decided to build my glam room and a very big inspiration as well and here i am now i think that's it i mean i don't really have a certain youtuber besides them too but i love watching like decoration videos and how to organize videos because that's pretty much what my channel is going to be about and it's just like not interesting to me but i just love watching it i just love organizing and having a place for everything and yeah do you speak any languages and how well i speak spanish and english and i sp i think i speak them perfectly i mean hey coquetica hey hey um okay next question are you single or taken i'm taken how long was your longest relationship three years how would you describe describe your fashion sense i'm very weird because i'm like the girliest tomboy you'll ever meet like i love being super chill with my sneakers when I give you guys a house tour, you guys will see I have like a big ass collection of high heels and I have a huge collection of sneakers. I'm a sneaker head for sure. So I don't even know what I have most, but yeah, my fashion sense, it all depends on my mood really. Baby, yo te boté. Cokers, hasta abajo, hasta abajo. Yo sé que con el tiempo la herida se cura. Que tú no te satura. What is your go-to hairstyle? Honestly, I just washed my hair and let it dry today. I did this because I kind of wanted to look cute for the video. But if I would have to pick, I would say this probably. But I usually just wash it and just let it air dry. How many siblings do you have? Wow, I think it's like 10 of us through my dad's side. I have half brothers and half sisters. 
I believe it is ooh. uh let me double check I believe it's like six girls and four guys I'm not sure right now I come from a big family let's just say my dad my dad was pretty busy back in his young years but yeah I have a big family and we all get along great I love all my brothers and sisters we're all pretty close um I do thank my dad for always taking care of all of us and making sure that you know that we always like communicated with each other and stayed close oh my gosh you guys i'm so sorry about how much my dogs were barking in the background uh, i literally did not notice till now that i'm editing this video but anyways here's a picture of my all my brothers and sisters along with my dad my stepmom and i and i am the one in the orange dress with black hair what is your go-to fast food order chipotle but y'all already knew that the ones that know me um your most memorable vacation memory when i took my mom to europe for her 50th birthday back in january we went to we went to spain we went to italy and we went to france and yeah i would i would have to say that because it was really special to me um do you have any bad habits? Probably saying um and like a lot. And do you have any bad habits? Um, I would say I am ex not extremely, but I am very OCD. So I don't know if that's a bad habit, but yeah. Tell us one thing about you that we wouldn't know. I am... Um, one thing about me that you guys wouldn't know, I used to break dance, or at least try to. Um, one thing about me that you guys wouldn't know. Oh, okay. I got it. So, I am a very big shoe freak. So, every time, literally every time I wear a pair of shoes, even if it's to, I don't know, wherever it is that I go. As soon as I come back, not as soon as I come back, but before I put them away, I have to clean them. I have Before I put them away where they belong. I am very big on that. I love my shoes. I love taking care of my shoes. So yeah, that is something that a lot of people don't know about me and find it very weird. My favorite Netflix show. I have a couple. I love Grey's Anatomy. I love La Casa de Papel, which is Money Heist. I think it's how you say it in English. I love, um, I, I love a lot. I love Pablo Escobar, El Patrón del Mal. Um, I would say pretty much that. I have a lot, so I'm just going to leave it at that. Uh, what is the craziest thing you have done? I don't think I'm ready to answer that question. But let's just say um, I'm, I'm really like not scared to do something crazy if I have to. Uh, what was your dream job as a kid? To be a vet. That was my dream job. What is your favorite thing to order on Uber Eats? Chipotle. Do you have any pets? Show them to us. Yes! I do. I have three. And here we go. Let's start with Little Miss Cokers. All right, Cokers, show us that post. Little mamas. All right. All right, girl. All right. What do you call that post, huh? You being a good girl? You're not sick anymore, mamas. Uh, you guys, I'm so annoyed because I try showing you guys the babies of the house, which are mini and lucky. But like I told you guys before, I recently started learning how to use my camera and stuff. And I guess the way I had it set up, it didn't go accordingly with the way that my lights were. And you guys could barely see them. But 
I promise I'll make another video with them where you guys will be able to see them. And yeah, sorry about that one more time. Hey guys, so I decided to cut this video short and make it into two parts because as some of you can tell, it's already 15 minutes long and I didn't want it to be extremely long. So I decided to cut it right here in this picture because as I told you guys earlier in the video, my little baby was sick. Um, I actually filmed this video about two months ago. Today is December 4th, which would have been Coqueta's 13th birthday. And she passed away on me about a week and a half ago, Saturday, November 23rd. And I am completely heartbroken as I sit here editing this video, which luckily enough, I was able to get her in it. And you guys were able to meet her, even if it was just for a little bit. Um, I think there's one or two more videos that I actually filmed as well where she's in them. And you guys will probably be able to see her in there. But yeah, that's why it took me so long to upload this video. Um, I will try to work on the second part this weekend or maybe next week so I could post it for you guys. <clears throat> but that's all I got to say for now. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And happy birthday, Cokers. Mommy loves you and misses you so, so much.